measure, let's talk about the profession attunement changes. Okay. So awesome. what you're going to do uh, as an elementalist, as a tempest, is you're going to be overloading your attunements. Um, and as we're, as we're seeing here, this is the overloaded fire version. Um, each time, you, like after a period of time of being in uh, of being in your attunement, you'll be able to uh, you'll be given the chance to overload it. Um, and that overload is intended to have like a large, like kind of a focus of like you should get away from me now, mm -hmm. sort of feeling to it, because this is gonna hurt. So this feels like since you're bringing us more into the front lines, I say us because my poor squishy elements. Was, <laughs> I was so scared about this, and I've been asking Carl. You know, I'm. It's gonna be okay, right? <laughs> Yep. Um, so that's our, that's our yeah. fire overload. I love so, yeah, water now, we're, now we're looking at the water overload. Water, uh, the over, yeah, the overload for water is <laughs> you're going to rapidly heal your allies um, and cleanse conditions off of them, and then after, when it ends, you're going to have a large uh, burst of healing and apply regeneration in an area around you. Okay, and the circle that we're seeing, that's kind of your range. Yeah, that's kind of the radius of it. So if you see that and the Ellie's doing it, get inside. Yeah. It'll, it'll make everything better. <laughs> These abilities, they go on full cooldown. So let's there's go, the lightning here's the lightning one. Um, and not all effects are final. And, <clears throat> yeah, we and, had, and um, damage numbers are not final. Like the overloading, overloading air, assuming it leaves like a, a lightning field behind you. And so like you can, you can kind of like channel and kite around. <laughs> Having fun was funny here. Yeah, I keep sending, I was apologizing to Carl, I keep sending the guys in to like go fight Swanier. Okay, now show me how this does. Go they, let this giant, Sometimes they're rough. Yeah, let me let me have this gigantic angry Norn just beat the crap out of you. So I'm sorry <laughs> again. But you did pretty well. It's all good. Um, here's the this overloaded earth. So when we talk about taking a ride on the earth, uh, this is what we're talking about here. You're going to pr pr provide a protection to all your nearby allies and can repeatedly cripple your enemies. Um, and then at the end of it, it delivers a blast to the area and it mobilizes all enemies in the area. I want to take, I know we've done this quite a lot on the show, I want to take a second though and give a shout out to the animators and yeah. everybody who made these look incredible. Because you have, like male and female have different animations mm -hmm. and they really put some work into this. Um, next, let's go, let's go talk about the Warhorn. Yay. So the Warhorn is going to bolster your ability to re remain in melee combat, and it's going to kind of, you know, promote actually staying around your allies and giving them wounds and that kind of thing. Um, right now what we're looking at is the Heat Sink, which is going to actually give you three sacks of might, and then it's going to spread all boons on you to your nearby allies. Ah, there we go. There's the Wildfire. Uh, so this is... Wildfire is your kind of area control fire skill. Um, you're going to lay that out as a carpet, and enemies that stand in it take damage, take burning. Um, it's a wide, it's a fire field, um, in, which is pretty good for your uh, for when you're uh, overloading your your fire to me because that's also a whirl combo. Yeah. So like you get into one fire field and you start spinning bolts around oh uh, the entire time. I love it. See, I've only I've been playing with this quite a bit. Uh, the, this is the. Uh, I get excited the, about the animation. This is the title surge. So the title surge <laughs> is going to heal nearby allies, um, and is going to, uh, and then and heal and regenerate nearby allies, and then it's going to push back in in front of you. I sat there and let you, so we can yeah. totally throw me under the bus on this one. So here, here here's go. the here's the uh, the lightning orb, and it's going to fire projectiles at nearby enemies, and get, dealing damage, applying vulnerability. Sort of if you, it, it, this one helps more if you have, if you can single somebody out, it'll fire like, you know, like eight or nine or ten different projectiles at them. If you can keep them immobilized in place, or if they're running away, you're absolutely going to annihilate them. Boy. Um, so what we're seeing right here is Cyclone. And what you can do is you're going to sort of blast out a, uh, uh, well, a cyclone, a cyclone. That, that, that snaps enemies straight to the center. <laughs> So it's gonna pull them in, and uh, it, it's got. It's kind of it's kind of scary right now. It also, and this, in addition to pulling enemies in, it'll give swiftness mm -hmm. to allies it it touches. This is what I need in a pet lightning pet. orb. <laughs> uh, it's so a lightning orb mini pet. You have your going over to the earth. You're gonna have sand squall. You're gonna apply protection to yourself, um, and then 
uh, and you're going to apply protection to yourself and the allies, and then you're going to increase the duration of all booms on your allies. Um, currently, we have this at two seconds increase, so that's going to be like you're going to apply two seconds of protection to you and your allies, and then you're going to amplify that up to four seconds mm -hmm. based on uh, and the initial applications based mm -hmm. on your own boom duration and stuff like that. Okay. Giving us really cool stuff to play with. Yeah. Um, the number five skill here uh, is going to be your dust storm. Dust storm right now it applies it's it's a pulsing blind field. So and each one of these little cyclones that you see is going to do its own little pulsing blind and it's going to also deal attacks. Uh, it does it pulses blind every two seconds, kind of sim sort of similar to a, a few other skills that you've seen. Um, I'm going to make an executive decision and yeah, please. hope that I this can't. is the best for your All right. talking flow. So we get your healing, healing skill, and this is called Wash the Pain Away. Uh, so great. Yeah, and it's going to heal you. It's going to heal at a at a gradually increasing radius. So it's really small at first, it's like 120, then it goes higher and then higher. Um, and it's like extends the healing outward. So the closer you are to your allies, the more healing you're going to get to them. Um, but it's a, it's pretty fast casting. Uh, it heals for quite a bit. And it heals actually right now the same amount. Um, let's see here. Right, here we go to the next one. We have Feel the Burn. I can't actually shout it out. James will like come in here and be unhappy with you. Quiet down. <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, so you're going to rapidly push out burning to your nearby enemies and grant fire aura to your nearby allies. So this is one of the places, uh, one of the, you'll notice with the, uh, six, uh, with the uh, recent trait changes, there have been, f there were fewer fire auras. Get, uh. uh, let's see here. Next one we have is shock and aftershock. So you're going to like release a, an initial burst that's going to cripple nearby enemies. And then they have about half a second before you, the next attack is delivered. And it, uh, and then immobilizes them. Over, oh yeah, so we have Eye of the Storm, Yay. which I don't think we got a whole lot of good uh, <laughs> video for. Just me running around. Yeah. I don't know, it works pretty well though. Eye so of what the does Storm. It do? So this thing is going to break stun for you and your nearby allies, and it's, it's going to grant right. all of them super speed. So you're going to be able to. Oh yeah. There, so here we go, we have Flash Freeze, and it's going to create a small area around nearby enemies, and they have like a very short time to actually get out of it. But. Um, so you're gonna yell flash and then freeze is when it's actually going to going to actually hit this more <laughs> I'm having so much fun and all I've done is just play with single skills not even combos Seriously, I feel like I'm gonna keep on harping on this But you're gonna have to really play around with this and kind of get used to it. It's Not one where you just pick it up and all right. I've got this down. I've got this master. All right. What we're yeah, well what we're seeing here is rebound um, and this is the uh, your elite, it's a low cooldown elite, um, and it's going to be, you know, your next skill has a 25% reduced recharge. So what we're seeing here is that I'm using rebound and then using wash the pain away.